here's the Icelandic artist Erol. We went to the Erol Museum in Reykjavik, and we stayed with a guy at a bed and breakfast who's a cousin of Erol, who's still alive, I believe, and he lives in Paris here somewhere. Really cool. This is the first Sunday of the month, so it's a heritage day here in France, and a lot of things are free. And this is the Pompidou Center, which Parisians tend to call Beaubourg. And we got here early. If you're going to come, whether it's a pay day, a paying day, or a free day, get here early because the lines can be really horrible. Oh, I don't like Larry Rivers. And um, this is a major attraction in Paris, so um, it can get really crowded here, and it's not not fun when it is. The permanent collections allow you to make videos and photos without flash, and in the temporary shows, you cannot. <laughs> And even on a free day like today, if you want to see a temporary thing, you still have to pay. But the permanent collection is free today. There's a cool channel I just found on YouTube of somebody here in Paris who takes us on tours of things which uh, are kind of hidden here or not well known. And I don't edit or provide links, but I will try to put some information in the low bar. We're going to we're going to look for the Anne Frank Garden. Oh, I like this one. Which is right by here, and it's pretty new, and we didn't know it was here. And I found out about it because of this cool channel. Oh, this reminds me of Ann van der Linden's stuff. She's a neighbor of mine. She's one of the first artists I met when I came here to Paris. And I've done a lot of projects with her over the years. I think we've got a book coming out next month. It, it'll be the third in the Freak Wave series. And I have something in it again this time. I really recommend the Freakwave books. If you like strange art, you'll you'll really like them. <laughs>